Hey, I'm ZSH Plays. Welcome to the Planet Zoo Eurasia Animal Park. We have eight gorgeous new animals coming to the game on the 13th of December, and today I'm going to tell you all about them. Firstly, let's just bathe in the glory of another Frontier teaser trailer. You get a good look at some of the animals here and a sneak peek at a few more. We're going to go over all the shots in more detail, along with some more screenshots that Frontier kindly sent me yesterday. Let's go! The star animal in the pack is the Wiesent, or European Bison. This is the heaviest lamb mammal in Europe, and I know a lot of people have been clamouring for this one. It features heavily in the trailer, so we get a really good look at it. I saw these at the Highland Wildlife Park in Scotland last year, and they are really impressive. They definitely make a great addition to European section in your zoos. And speaking of zoos, I already have a European forest section planned for San Bernardino Zoo, so I'm loving all the new options we get for that in this new pack. Next up is an animal very high on the wish list, the Wolverine. These guys are so unique. I saw one at the Highland Wildlife Park as well, tearing around his enclosure, and they are fascinating. I always think of them as being what I imagined the Tasmanian Devil to be before I discovered that they are actually just small and cute. I'm pretty sure these guys will be coming to San Bernardino Zoo in the Frozen North section I have planned later in the series. Onto the most widespread animal in the pack, the wild boar. These are the biggest of the pigs or suids, live all across Eurasia and even Africa in just about every habitat imaginable, so it'll be a great filler animal for your zoos. Apparently there's new animations for these guys as well, so they'll be distinct from the peccary, etc. Next up is an animal I think you're either going to love or hate, the mute swan. I don't think I've ever seen a swan being kept in a zoo, but I've certainly seen them in zoos, and they'll make an amazing ambient animal, very different to the other birds that we have. You can barely see them in the trailer, but I've got some shots that Frontier sent me where you can see a little more of them. I'm looking forward to seeing these up close, and I'll definitely be going into the European area at San Bernardino. We get the briefest of glimpses at the Saiga in the trailer. I think George Lucas must have been a fan of these. This is another choice that will split opinion as there's only one zoo in the whole world that holds them and that's in their native range in Kazakhstan. However, if there's one animal on this planet that's in desperate need of saving, this is it. I'm considering dedicating a large habitat to them in our zoo to start the world's breeding program after all the troubles that the Saiga has had recently. We've also got three more animals coming in the Eurasia animal pack that we are yet to see. The sloth bear, which I cannot wait for. They are amazing and will be coming to San Bernardino very soon. The tarkin, which is the largest of the caprines, i.e. goats, etc. And finally, Herman's tortoise. Yes, we are finally getting a normal sized tortoise in the game. I cannot wait to see them and they'll be the exhibit animal for this pack. The pack also includes a new scenario map and therefore a new statue. And finally, releasing alongside the Eurasia Animal Pack is update 1.16, which includes modular souvenir shops. If you saw the live screen last night, you'll know all about these. They're going to be super customizable and I cannot wait to build one. That's everything I know right now. I'll see you on Saturday for a new episode of San Bernardino Zoo. And again, very shortly afterwards for a very special episode. Thanks for watching. Bye.